with my gorgeous friend Haley Duff. She is the actress extraordinaire and also has a cooking blog of her very own called Wheel Girls Kitchen. Yes. And we are in her Wheel Girls Kitchen. This is it. Right now, and we're gonna make Sundays three ways. Three way Sunday. Three way Sunday. Sounds like a good day. Yeah. <laughs> knock knock. I'm Mr. Kate. I'm here. I'll take a look at your place. Oh, I'll drop by for a while. Mr. Kate. I'll help you find your style. Mr. Kate. We'll laugh. We'll paint. I'm Mr. Kate. Yay! Look at this gorgeous ice cream. And all vegan friendly. Yes, that is a must to say. It is all vegan friendly. It's perfect for a midday. <laughs> sort of for lunch. We're sort of like working off of recipes that I found and composite and, and replaced. Childhood memories. Yeah. Oh yeah, she's got fond memories of Diana. <laughs> I have fun. I'll just stop right there. <laughs> so the first guy we're gonna do, yes, is a vegan salted caramel, which is possible. I hope. So we're gonna try to use as much like low glycemic stuff as possible. We're starting out with good ingredients, so no matter what, if it doesn't end up looking pretty, it'll taste fucking good. Now in another pan, we have to put together sugar, water, and agave. So we gotta heat that up to 248 degrees. Now when making like any kind of caramelly kind of stuff, you need a candy thermometer because it is essential to get it to that perfect temperature because then you get into the candy mode. Don't let the shape and size of it intimidate you. Whoa. <laughs> it's not meant to. Shut it, shut so it. Good. I think that's done. So we're gonna set that aside and we're gonna get on to our, our next adventure. So if you're feeling lazy and you're vegan and you want something that's not totally high glycemic and you wanna like a hot fudge sundae, this is great stuff. So let's make sure this is on low. This is heating up. And then I think let's get into bananas. Foster. Foster. We should get it all ready. Okay. Because it's gonna heat up really fast. Yeah, and we gotta light it on fire. <gasps> She's really excited. I'm really excited, I'm really, I'm really scared. <laughs> See, I feel like we need maybe more, more butter. butter. My mom was like, don't skimp on the butter. When in doubt, Chop nuts. Can I show you my ghetto favorite way? Oh, you have a favorite, please. I do, and it's literally so ghetto. Oh, yeah. I go like this, and I ball it up, and I just break them. That's smart. Ooh. I don't know where I can Nothing like the feeling of breaking nuts in my hand. What? <laughs> this stuff is not melting as easily as real sugar would. You Sometimes think? there's just no substitute. For real sugar? Yeah, look at it. Well, it might be Lumpy, Lumpy's Foster. Chunky Foster. <laughs> Chunky's Foster! Mama always knows. What did she, she say? Ought. She said, don't substitute anything. Use real butter. Don't be scared of the butter. We did everything she told us not to do. Regardless, <laughs> it smells really good. It smells really good, and like we said in the beginning, we're starting out with good ingredients, so even if it doesn't turn out like... You put them all in? Professional chef, yeah. It's gonna be good. So here's one thing that is good to keep in mind when you're cooking something you've never made before, because mistakes happen all the time. Modify what your original plan was gonna be. Yeah, totally. You know? And then sometimes it comes out better. Yeah, I think that's Hopefully in this case that's what's gonna happen. When in doubt, add liquor. Done, and we're gonna delve. Which one first? That's I'm going salted so caramel. Okay, here we go. That's pretty good. 
Oh, it's really good, but the coffee kind of overpowers the salt. Is that what it is? Like something was coming through a little too strong, I felt like. Yeah, the salted caramel sauce is so good. But yeah, I think with like a vanilla or something. I'm trying the underdog, Chunky's Foster. That's because you're kind. I am kind. Oh! That's pretty good. This is legit. But it's just the process is so terrifying. It looks like it's It was really terrifying. Bombing. We. Right? That's the best one. <laughs> That's better than the this underdog. One. Everybody likes an underdog. It's just when you think it's going wrong, it goes so, so right. Just like Dancing with the Stars. Try that one. What do you think of that one? <laughs> it's so attractive. Mm. Mm. We didn't do much for that one, but that sure is good. Yeah, so if you're going to indulge, you can still indulge in. Guilty, less guilty stuff. I have to say though, I think the ice cream is so good. Really good, right? It's so creamy. Yep, Haley and Kate's Chunky Foster wins the day. Ta da! Thanks for hanging out with us. It was good to have you. Good to laugh, good to eat. And we'll see you again soon. Bye. Bye. God, you're lighting it. Oh you're my God! It. I'm wearing polyester. This is Mr. It's Kate. Flammable. You're lighting it. I'm not the one. Okay. I'm not the one. <laughs>